So today's question is how often do I need to paint? That is all up to you. I have painted for some homeowners um, after three years, you know, or bedrooms after two years. Um, we've painted, we've repainted a whole entire house, maybe eight years after doing it the previous time. Interior paint, for the most part, doesn't necessarily wear out. Now, if you use a very low quality paint, if you use flat, a lot of times there's no durability on those surfaces, and so it'll look dirty and worn out and those kinds of things. Um, so there's a lot of factors that come into play, but I would say the biggest factor for interior painting on how often you should paint is, is trends. You know, people get tired. For a long time, um, here in Denver at least, uh, we were going darker and darker and darker. I mean, to the point where we got chocolate browns on walls and ceilings. And about two, three years ago, we, we kind of hit the tipping point and switched, and now we're going to light gray. Uh, a lot of light colors, off-whites, light taupes. Um, so very much more light and bright, and that is probably the biggest factor of when to paint. And I would say trends typically stick around for about a decade. So you're going to get 8, 10, 12 years out of your paint job um, just from a decor standpoint. And let me remind you that painting your house is the least expensive thing you can do that transforms a space. Because, um, I mean, think about it. So if my average project size is about $3,500, Think about other decor things in your house that you can spend money on um, for $3,500. You can get a part of a, a dining room set. You may get a chest of drawers. You, can, you, you can't really do much in your kitchen. You can repaint your kitchen cabinets, but there's no way you could reface them or change them out. So painting um, for the dollar goes further than anything you can do interior design-wise. Um, so I hope that helps.